Hi, today I'm going to inform you on the top 10 most dangerous roads you would do anything in the world to avoid driving on. Let's not waste any more time and get straight to the point. Number 10. The Lee Passage du Gois, located in France, is an extremely dangerous road that you wouldn't want to travel on that leads to the island of Normantior. This road is notorious for going underwater at least twice a day, around an average of a couple hours at a time. When the tide gets way too powerful, it will take your car and you underwater, potentially leaving you to drown. That is why this road is so risky. Try to imagine the pain of drowning with no one to hear you scream as bubbles fly out of your mouth. Not to mention, drowning is up there with one of the worst ways to go. One of the worst ways to die. If you must cross this road, it has to be when the tide is low. If the tide rises midway through, you must pedal to the metal to get to your destination. This road is both suspenseful and kind of gorgeous in a way, but this is a dangerous road. You would literally do anything to avoid driving on, nevertheless. Number 9. The Tianmen Mountain National Forest Park Road, located in Yangding, Xinjiangji, China. It is a crazy side-winding road with a pretty high death rate that leads to the famous Tianmen Cave. Tianmen Mountain Road is notorious for its fierce bending and twisting by design. One wrong turn and it may be the last sight you ever see on this planet. This road, which like a creation from your dreams and nightmares that dwells on the Tianmen Mountain, is around 6.8 miles in length with nearly 100 bends on a mountain around 430 feet high will take you directly to the Tianmen Cave. Around the mountains, there are really, really, really tall trees that almost seem to touch the sky. The beautiful nature around this road seems to attract quite a lot of tourists here. So crossing this road is a must to see the full view. Most people are willing to take the risk of death and reach the cave. While this is truly one beautiful and scary road, it should be said to drive over this road with extreme caution to avoid falling off the edge as plenty of you have before. Number 8 the Col de la Bonnet Road, located on an extraordinarily sky-high mountain pass in France, right next to the border of Italy, lies an extremely dangerous road with multiple steep twists and sharp turns, conjuring up a remarkable death toll due to the people falling off the side of the road in mass. The Col de la Bonne road is the highest road in Europe as of the 21st century. This road reaches an altitude of 9,193 feet. Keeping the fact that multiple people died on this road in the back of your mind while driving on this road will sure spark an adrenaline rush. If you're not careful, you can fall off of this road too. The difference between this road and other roads is that it's really high on a mountain pass with no walls or barriers on the side, making the potential fall deadly because your car would tumble down the mountain for a really, really long time, creating a scenario where it would be nearly impossible to escape while your car does multiple flips with you inside it. It would make chances of survival unlikely, with you hitting everything in your car at a crippling breakneck pace, while dashing all hope, putting fear in its place, while you blast off, inevitably, just like Team Rocket. Number 7. The Island County Bridge, located in Washington, also known as Deception Pass Bridge, which connects two lane bridges on Washington State Route 20 and Whidbey Island to Fidelgo Island, located in the U.S. state of Washington. The road slash bridge is easily the scariest on this list to cross. 
While the Island County Bridge doesn't have the highest death count on this list, the road still has a high death count, which is problematic considering that this bridge feels poorly made with a wacky design, with an immense and towering mass body of water beneath you. There have been plenty of people that fell to their deaths due to the barriers not being powerful enough, which gives you a false sense of security. And this is why Deception Pass Bridge is notoriously called the Bridge of Death. It's not really that safe. Number 6. The Taroko Gorge Road, located in Taiwan, that leads to the Taroko National Park which is one of the nine national parks in Taiwan. This road is located on the edge of another mountain route made by carving out rocks. As you can guess, there have been plenty of people who fell to their death due to the steep and tongue-twisting turns on the edge of the mountain. However, this would be a great adventure for an adrenaline junkie looking to satiate the appetite for fearlessness and power and pawa. Just be cautious and understand that the consequences for failure is death, and nothing less and nothing more. Number 5 The Goliang Tunnel Road located in China is carved along the edge of a mountain and has been responsible for far too many deaths. This specific location was named after a historical fugitive outlaw during the Han Dynasty era who stood his ground to defend his village against an empirical enemy force at that time. This Goliang Tunnel Road was given the name in response to show honor, gratitude, and respect for his protection of the land. The tunnel leads straight to the Taihang Mountains, which are situated in Huyaxian Xingjingta, which are... S <laughs> which are... S which are situated in Huyaxian Xingxiang, Henan province of China. Just be cautious and careful when driving on the scary but beautiful and dangerous side winding with sharp turns road. Number 4 the Commonwealth Avenue Road, located in the Philippines, is an extremely dangerous road that you would never want to drive on, and it is commonly referred to as Killer Highway due to the crazy high fatality slash mortality rate. Traffic laws and rules and road safety regulations are almost completely obsolete. The road is nearly 8 miles long around 7.7 .7 miles to be exact, and has 18 lanes. It is currently the widest road in the Philippines. Due to the lack of safety on Commonwealth Avenue, every day there is three to five accidents resulting in death for many. Researchers suggest almost 7,000 people die annually. So if you're going to cross this highway, be honest with yourself about your chances of survival. Number 3 The A537 Road, also known as the Widowmaker, located in the United Kingdom, is an infamously dangerous road you would do literally anything in the world to avoid driving on due to its sky-high fatality rate. This road has destroyed so many lives. What makes the Widowmaker Road so dangerous is its unregulated sharp bends, frequent slaying of livestock, and side-winding sharp turns mixed with bad slippery weather is enough to cause multiple and major car crashes as it has. The death toll is extremely high. This road is notorious for wrecking your car as well. If you cross this road, just understand the reality that you are not invincible and one mistake may be your last. Number 2. The Kabul Jalalabad Highway located in Afghanistan, also known as the Valley of Death. Due to the highway's extreme traffic, Taliban territory and other terrorist groups setting bombs and other attacks 
kidnappings, killings, etc. No rules with a poorly constructed and built road mixed with bad weather. This dangerous road would make you do anything in the world but to drive on it. As this road claims over 200 lives annually. Just simply by being near this road, you are in more danger than you know. So be afraid, very afraid, and let the fear inside you. Just keep a clear head on your shoulders and drive carefully and cautiously as if you are walking on a tightrope. Number one. The North Youngest Road, also known as the Road of Death, is located on a road leading from La Paz to Corico, 56 kilometers northeast of La Paz in the youngest region of Bolivia. You would literally do anything, I mean anything, to avoid driving on this road. This road was built by slaves and former enemy soldiers in the 1930s. This road is so unreliable and unbearable and dangerous to the point where it's not even worth crossing. This road costs so many people their lives. This road kills 300 plus people annually. So there's a very good reason to call this location the road of death. This is just another dangerous road you would literally do anything in the world to avoid driving on. Hello there, this is Alex Carnifex. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, be sure to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more amazing content. And also check out some of my other videos while you're at it.